This is mainly a scenery video, but if you are an aviation fanatic, please skip to 2 minutes and 10 seconds to see some epic footage of the beluga circling overhead. So, after a stormy start to the year to say the very least, me and my friend got out over the weekend to do a couple of shorter, gentler walks up some of the lower and more forgiving Welsh hills. When we had to walk on top of a wall to avoid getting wet feet within about 3 seconds of leaving the tarmac, it was a good reminder of what it's like to go walking at any point other than the height of summer it seems. So this video isn't intended to be specifically about these low, less famous hilltops themselves, and more about what they represent, and that is firstly a good bit of exercise as you can imagine, but also some fantastic hours spent in an absolutely wonderful environment, and with what I will broadly call some adequate company. I'm hoping that my friend will think that's funny if he watches this, well I'm hoping my friend will even watch this, <laughs> but in all seriousness though, it is incredibly easy to get dazzled by the famous mountain names and to constantly want to run off and do the big hills and that's where you then start to miss out on some of these simpler and gentler experiences and there are of course benefits to this the first one being the fact that you can keep going out more frequently because you're not turning yourself to jelly doing the huge famous mountains but even beyond that at a much simpler level because these hilltops are so much less popular because they don't have that big famous name or height attached to them it means that you can come out for hours on end to beautiful places like this and sometimes literally not see anybody or at the very least as we did on both of our trips go for hours on end without seeing a single other person here's a weird detail for you my friends i posted a short clip of this object on facebook and it got over a million views so while i'm saying that we were on the hilltop alone Ultimately, I ended up accidentally fetching over a million people up here with us. I'm going to end this video with a few clips of the absolutely epic Beluga aircraft circling overhead. In the best stroke of luck and once again a huge benefit of being out in this area rather than over towards the coast with some of the bigger mountains, we were not far away from the Airbus factory at Broughton, and so only moments away from getting in the car and leaving without ever seeing it at all, we got to stand in a field and see it circle overhead as it got rid of a bit of altitude ready to come in for landing. What a fantastic bookend to a wonderful weekend. Thank you so much for watching my friends, please consider following me, feel free to check the links in the description to find me posting videos and pictures like these all over the internet. Until the next time my friends, keep it interesting, have a fantastic day and farewell.